Hey guys, welcome to Digit, and this is going to be yet another unboxing and overview of a DIY electronics component. In this case, this happens to be a dot matrix display, and that too, one that is set up in a cascading formation. So, this thing is based on the Max 7219IC. So, uh, that's a very popular eight segment or other dmd driver and that allows us to drive all of these leds in whichever way that we choose and this particular package comes with four displays which can be seen by the little distinguishing line between them so you have an eight by eight segment display and four of them connected in a cascade formation and a little jumper wire to connect this to your Arduino or Raspberry Pi, whatever you're using. Now, this is a fairly simple configuration if you look at it. On the bottom side, you can see that uh, the circuit is segmented, as in this is one independent circuit of its own, and you have four such circuits that are connected one behind the other in the aforementioned cascade formation, and you only need to control the very end bit to sort of power the entire board and to have your uh, display channeling throughout the what do you call the segment now because this is a 7219 uh, based uh, segment display you don't have to individually control all the separate uh, units which is the benefit of using 7219 and on top of that it's actually compatible with a lot of these boards because uh, the only thing that you require is power obviously so that's the VCC and GND that's ground and then you have a D in that is a digital input a CS that is chip select and clock in order to figure out how quickly uh, the display is going to be cascading across the screen now these things are individually removable so it's kind of difficult but uh, if you sit your finger in you should be able to pull them out one by one you have to be a little careful because you don't want to bend the pins the entire assembly is taken out so underneath that you can see the max 7219 ic right in the center and you have the connector pins uh, in the form of little uh, standoffs onto which these little modules go so you can easily look at uh, what do you call this circuit design and extend it as much as you want each of these individual 8x8 bit displays are also purchasable separately but uh, let's say you want to use it with the standard sketches uh, then the maximum i think uh, most of these sketches support is eight units so you can have two of these in uh, series and you'll have to attach I believe another of these four pin connectors, sorry, five pin connectors at this end, and then you can switch the two together. Now, overall, uh, this isn't complex at all. The only difference that, or other thing that you need to remember is that because this is an eight by eight bit display, you have 64 LEDs, and each of these LEDs consumes about 10 milliampers. So overall, one module takes up 640 milliampers when you're connecting it to a single uh, Arduino board. Now, that's it for uh, this particular unboxing and quick overview of the 8x8-bit uh, FC16 dot matrix display. Mm -hmm.